Good morning. This is Athena Starseed and this is a series called Raising Reverence and I am at my home temple and yesterday was a big day for me. Um, two days ago I saw a shooting star as I was driving home from Venice Beach and it was huge. It streaked across the sky and so I have this huge connection with the stars. I uh, call myself Athena Star Seed because when I was little I used to talk to the stars and I used to imagine them blinking back and I would hear thought forms and I would see visuals. So I felt this very strong communication. So when I see a shooting star, I take it very close to my heart. So I drove home and I saw that shooting star and I got really excited. And the next day, which is yesterday, I test drove my dream car, which is a Tesla. And I'd been wanting to do this for, I mean, I don't know, almost 15 years since I heard about Tesla, since I studied Nikola Tesla, since I had a Tesla coil made in my other home, which was called Temple Saqqara, based on the pharaohs in Egypt that would take people through the mystery schools of esoteric training, the body, the emotions, the mind, the soul, the ka body, the ra ka, the light body. And so I drove the test car. I test drove the car. And they basically told me, take it home and keep it overnight. And I was a little nervous, but I did it. And I remembered the feeling when I drove my first Mercedes. I was 25 years old. I had dreamed of a Mercedes. My uncle and aunt had a Mercedes. They had had their own construction company business. They used to build these uh, metro tunnels um, in Maryland and in DC. And I remember my uncle Bobby always would have a, a new Mercedes. And he told me, you need to imagine and open your heart and see with your mind's eye what's possible. So when I was 25, I tested for Mercedes and I was nervous. And that same nervous feeling came over me yesterday. But I got in the car and when she said, take it home, I was like, oh, okay. So I woke up today and it's in my driveway. And I just wanna show you because it feels really natural. It feels really good. It feels really comfortable. I have my little angel wings on. I don't know if you can see them, but there they are. I wear my little angel wings because it reminds me to be a messenger of light. And there's always things to be grateful for and there's always things to be filled with light. And there it is. There it is. It's in the driveway. Ah! All right, so let's just take a look at it from the back and the side. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. Um, I typically love to drive white cars, so I actually had them write up a white car. Um, and I am gonna go to my credit union and uh, start investigating the process now because first you imagine something then second once you see that it's possible the universe corresponds to your song and I want you to look at that see that seven seven that's a sign for me the messages are everywhere the universe is singing and this Tesla oh my gosh I remember I wanted to see a swing in this tree and then one day Oh, there it is. Look at that. I have the swing that I manifested and I also have the Tesla. So now I'm going to sit on the swing under this beautiful, glorious tree <laughs> and I'm going to swing like a little child because lest ye be like little children, we shall not inherit the kingdom of heaven and the kingdom of heaven is within and we are all angels on the inside. We all are filled with light and here is my view swinging <laughs> in my front yard in the city of angels with my angel wings looking at that beautiful tesla anything is possible everything is possible when you know who you are and you know why you're here and you become an example of the joy and the love in your heart and that's when your cup runs over and that's what you share and that's what you sing and that's what you say and so I'm gonna share my dream with you my dream is to travel around the country and teach people about um, breatharianism and to sing to sing music 
And so I sing mantras, and I'll put a link at the bottom where you can hear the Supreme Grace Light Mantra song. And it's about opening up your light body. And it has all these wonderful sacred sounds. Some are in Sanskrit, some are in Tamil, some are in Guru Mukhi. Um, but they're all filled with light, with holy light, just like you are. So this is Athena Starseed. There's the Tesla. That's the dream. You'll be... It, I mean, you'll just be as amazed as I am on how this is going to happen because part of um, the materialization process is our responsibility is to let the dream in, color it in, imagine it, viscerally test drive the car, feel the feelings of it, and be grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you for that which is. And then it's the universe's responsibility to do its part. So thank you so much. This is Athena Starcy. This is a series called Raising Reverence. Dreams do come true. Blessings and light. Stay tuned.